Hi friends, welcome to Tivan Academy. We are seeing one of the important areas that is Vande Matram moment in Hyderabad. Vande Matram. Vande Matram moment. Vande Matram moment in Hyderabad. Vande Matram moment in Hyderabad. That's another task. Vande Matram moment that was started in Hyderabad in which year? In the year 1938. You know what? In the year 1938. What are the causes for this one? In 1937, anniversary of Usmania University and many guests were invited. Chief guest was Muhammad Ali Jinnah. This is Muhammad Ali Jinnah. 1937 anniversary of Usmania University. For the anniversary of anniversary for the anniversary of Usmania University 1937 Muhammad Ali Jinnah Muhammad Ali Jinnah Muhammad Ali Jinnah was invited who was invited Muhammad Ali Jinnah was was invited Muhammad Ali Jinnah was invited got idea so for the anniversary of OU Usmania University 1937, Muhammad Ali Jinnah was invited. So this Muhammad Ali Jinnah, while addressing the students, he said that, he said what in the sense? My dear Muslim students, he did not speak anything to Hindus. Hindu will bring Jem Matla Ledu. Na Prima in a Muslim with Dartalara, Ani Pair Kunade Tapa, Hindu will bring Jem and Ledu. Idi Hitula Kento, Badakal in Chedlaga, Telesan. With that, they started giving slogans against this Zinna and they started singing Vande Matram song. So then it was objected by Muslim students because during that time half of the students in Usmania University belong to Hindu and half of the students belong to Muslim community. Because throughout India, Muslim community they are coming to Usmania University. Urdu language that existed, English also existed. Okay, like that. So that's why people were coming to join. So this Usmania University, got idea? So at this moment, what happened? So in Usmania University, when they asked these people not to sing Vande Matram, that's one of the, uh, this one. So then, uniform they introduced. So there is especially what happened? Muhammad Ali Jinnah was invited and he said, and he addressed, and he said, my dear Muslim students, my dear Muslim students, my dear Muslim as students like that, he said, he addressed the students, okay. So he did not speak anything about Hindus, with that only, so disparity arose, this disparity arose between Hindus and Muslims. Hindu students started singing Vande Matram, but that was, so there is denied or rejected by Muslim community students like that, disparities arose. At this moment, because of Ramjan festival, holidays were declared to Usmani University. Then after coming back on the notice board, so on the notice board, after Ramjan festival, after Ramjan, so this after Ramjan festival, after Ramjan festival, Usmani University was reopened, was reopened. Reopened, reopened, and it is said that. So, and on the notice board they pasted. On the notice board it is said that, Vande Matram song was banned, reopened, and said that nobody should sing Vande Matram. Vande Matram song was banned, and said that, and said that, okay, and said that Vande Matram song said that Vande Matram song was banned. Vande Matram Vande Matram song Vande Matram song was banned. This song was banned like that it was said. Vande Matram song was banned like that it was said. Okay. So like this all these important things uh, went on well. So at this moment what happened? Hindu students they started so this uh, one day matra moment on 29th November and it continued till December 10th. Hindu students, 
Hindu students started Hindu students started Vande Mataram movement Vande Mataram Vande Mataram movement Vande Mataram movement on 29th on 29th November 29th November so that is 1938 1938 and it continued till December 10th it continued till this Vande Matra movement in Hyderabad it continued till December 10th it continued it continued till December 10th December 10th 1938 Okay, he won the mother with them in the Prada Consagindi. Income or Ingo Kakarana Minti when they matrangante. So there's blue uniform that was introduced, blue uniform that was not liked by Hindu community people. That is also one of the uh, things like that it was said. Okay, Ila, some reasons they are there for the outbreak of this one. At this moment, one day Matram Lo, Mary Jarina Sangatana, 350 students from Usmani University at midnight. They were sent out, okay, by issuing even thesis, okay. And with this, 350 students, 350 students of OU, Usmania University, were sent out, were sent out, were sent out. All these took shelter there at Sultan Bajar Koti Jain Temple. At last, all these students, all these, all these students, all these uh, students, all these students took shelter, took shelter, took shelter at Yakadavilu Basa Chesaru, Sultan Bazar Koti Jain Temple, took shelter at Sultan Bazar, Sultan Bazar Koti, Sultan Bazar Koti, okay, Sultan Bazar Koti, okay. Well, Sultan Bazar Koti lo busches net laga telasundi. Took shelter there at Sultan Bazar Koti Jain Temple ani annam. He Jain Temple lo well busches saru. So they were so supported by Hyderabad State Congress. Even though ban that was there, but Hyderabad State Congress supported this movement. He Hyderabad State Congress ani the well a kani airport which is sundi. Because 350 students. Previously, they were taking so lunch, dinner, all these in the hostel, Usmania hostel. But now, so they are all sent out. Who will provide all the things? So lunch, dinner, all these arranged by so this Hyderabad State Congress only. So there is all the activities continued. Okay, by the students. So my treatment is under them. Lo, one day, matram movement became a serious movement in Usmania University B Hostel and Jepson. Took shelter in Jain Temple. Hyderabad State Congress. Hyderabad State Congress. Hyderabad State Congress supported. Supported. One day matram movement. One day matram. This one day matram movement. One day matram movement. This one day matram movement ni support this net laga thilas sundi. Villa calls in one year. Portal jaise sundi gada. Idi anje pesi yanna. Mari city college nchi. Nearly 70 students ever sent out. Gulbarga nearly 300 students they are sent out. Alla pedda yatna jariyan dey. E one day matram udhimu mo anje pesi yanna. So Abdul Qadir Siddiqui. So theological studies of so the Susmania University. He was a professor Abdul Qadir Siddiqui. So he was uh, so coming by car. Driver was a Hindu. When he was going by car there in Usmania University, then all the students objected and started giving the slogans one day matram. Abdul Qadir Siddiqui. So when he was going, Abdul Qadir Siddiqui, professor. Professor Abdul, Abdul Qadir Siddiqui, when Abdul Qadir Siddiqui, so Professor Abdul Qadir Siddiqui, when he was going, when he was, when he was going, when he was going by car, when he was going by car in Voyu, Usmania University, students objected, students 
student subjected student subjected okay so but abdul qadir siddiqui he said to his driver so whatever may happen you move the car so yeah, some people may get injuries also you don't think but you drive the car like that he said to the driver but the driver was a hindu immediately stopped the car handed over the keys to abdul qadir siddiqui meer car nadapkondi ani cheppesi ivadam jarigindi em ayipoyina paravaledu entha mandi gaayalu tagilina paravaledu ledha entha mandi chanipoyina paravaledu motta andari gundane car theesukellam ani cheppadam mari hindu driver emo car ni aapeyadam jarigindi so driver was a hindu so there is going by car and who is student subjected so at this moment what happened so there is a disturbances arose okay between between abdul qadir siddiqui and the students hindu driver stopped the car and went away so then abdul qadir siddiqui fled away from this place okay so at last what happened to protect himself abdul qadir siddiqui okay so there is a ఫ్లడ్ అవే ఓకే సో ఇలా ముందే మాత్రం మూమెంట్ అనే పెద్ద ఎత్తున జరిగినట్లుగా తెలుస్తుంది అని చెప్పేసి అన్నాం సో దేస్ బట్ ఆస్కర్ ద డ్రైవర్ బట్ సో హీ ఆస్కర్ ద డ్రైవర్ టు కంటిన్యూ హీ ఆస్కర్డ్ హీ ఆస్కర్డ్ ద డ్రైవర్ హీ ఆస్కర్ ద డ్రైవర్ సో టు కంటిన్యూ ఓకే హీ ఆస్కర్డ్ ద డ్రైవర్ సో టు రన్ ద కార్ to run the car on the students to run the car on the uh, students to run the car on the students but hindu driver stopped this but hindu driver hindu driver stopped the car hindu driver stopped the car stopped the car and abdul qadir siddiqui so he got fear and fled away like that so all these uh, things they happened so in one day matra movement so at last what happened admission that was uh, given to these people okay in nagpur university maharashtra and at dk corve okay so like that so all these students so out of these 350 students pv narsimha rao arutla ramachandra reddy achyuta reddy etc so they were also students during that time during that time in vande matra movement so the students who were so days came out of university were 350 students among 350 students in connection with in connection with vande matram in connection with vande matram vande matram in connection with vande matram okay 350 students were i uh, sent out okay yeah along with the in this 350 students in connection with vande matram when students were sent out when students were sent out when students were sent out were sent out they are not accepted in chennai university they are not accepted in andhra university also okay in connection with vande matram movement when students were sent out so they so from university they were not accepted they were they were not accepted they were not accepted by andhra university andhra university because nizam supported some money to andhra university so and chennai university also and madras university also madras university madras university also why this madras university rejected because in mulki period what happened in 1990 1935 period mainly in 1935 period in mulki period they gave the slogan idli sambar go back so because non locals from chennai they lived in hyderabad and other places of telangana so against them only slogans have been given idli sambar go back like that that's why so that what happened in the sense so these people okay so especially what happened so they did not uh, give admissions to this at last these students went to maharashtra nagpur university at last at last these students these students 
went to Maharashtra, went to, to went to Maharashtra, went to Maharashtra like that it was said to continue their studies. Okay. Among these 350 students, among, among the students, among the students during that time, during that time, among the students during that time, P.V. Narasimharao is also one. P.V. Narasimharao, so yeah, Chuta Reddy, Arutla Ramachandra Reddy, etc. existed. P.V. Narasimharao, P.V. Narasimharao, P.V. Narasimharao, okay, P.V. Narasimharao, he is one. Arutla Ramachandra Reddy, Arutla Ramachandra Reddy, Arutla Ramachandra Reddy, okay. Achyuta Reddy, Achyuta Reddy is also one. Achyuta Reddy, Achyuta Reddy, etc. also, etc. existed, etc. existed like that it was said. So they all went. So this P.V. Nasimar also went to Maharashtra and Apur University and he joined there. With that only, he came to learn number of languages. He liked to learn languages and he became polyglot. P.V. Nasimhara learned many things from this at last. With that knowledge only, so he became Prime Minister and at the same time, so this Chief Minister and Prime Minister also. P.V. Nasimhara later worked as Chief Minister of so this Andhra Pradesh and after that Prime Minister of India. So later, okay, later, later P.V. Nasimhara you know well. P.V. Nasimhara. P. V. Narasimha Rao, later P. V. Narasimha Rao acted as, acted as CM, Chief Minister, acted as Chief Minister and even Prime Minister also, Prime Minister also. So like that, that's the incident which happened. Got idea? So like this, all these important things, they went on well in the period of this one. So later, so this P. V. Narasimha Rao became Prime Minister like that we can say. What idea? So after Jai Telangana movement only what happened? In Jai Telangana, Jai Andhra movement. Jai Telangana movement that was in 1969. Jai Andhra movement that's in the year 1972. In connection with that only, what happened? So there is P.V. Narasimha Rao. P.V. Narasimha Rao. So he was appointed as, as the, at that moment. And because of Jai Andhra movement, he resigned to CM post in Andhra Pradesh. He resigned to CM post in Andhra Pradesh like that. It was said. Okay. So like that, so all these important things, they happened in the period of this. So Nizam's period only. So then, during this time only, so if we see in the year 1930s, 1930s, Andhra Mahasabhas were also conducted. Andhra Mahasabhas were calling. Andhra Mahasabhas and Mahila Sabhas, they are also there. We are going to see them separately. Okay. So in 1930s only. So it was named as Nizam Andhra Mahasabha. But Nizam did not accept for that. That's why they named this one as Andhra Mahasabha. So at last what happened in the sense, India became free from the clutches of the British. That is 15th August 1947. But Hyderabad did not join Indian Union. Okay. So this especially what happened, Hyderabad, India became. Okay. India became. India became so free from the clutches of free from the clutches of the British free from the clutches clutches of the clutches of the British free from the clutches of the British and became independent and became and became independent independent and became independent Okay, clutches of the British and became independent like that we can say. But Hyderabad did not join in this. Hyderabad, what happened in the sense? This Hyderabad did not join. Hyderabad did not join. Hyderabad did not join Indian Union. Did not join Indian Union. Okay. Even Hyderabad State Congress, Hyderabad State Congress so conducted join India movement. 
Hyderabad State Congress under Swami Ramananda Tirtha. That is 1947, August 7th only. Join India Movement that was celebrated by. So there is a Join India Day that was celebrated by Hyderabad State Congress. Okay, but Hyderabad did not join or Mir Usman Ali Khan he did not join. So Join India Day. Join India Day. Hyderabad State Congress. Hyderabad State Congress. Hyderabad State Congress celebrated. Hyderabad State Congress celebrated Join India Day. Okay. So Join India Day. So that is Join India. Okay. Join India Day. So that is on 7th August. 1947, 7th August 1947, Join India Day, okay, 7th August, 7th August 1947 only, so it was conducted, but what happened in the sense, Hyderabad did not join, and at the same time, Nizam said that nobody should hoist national flag of India in Hyderabad state, Nizam also said that, like that. Nizam Emin Jepadu, Hyderabad Rajam Lo Ever Guda, Trivana Pataka Negrave Guru and Japi, Perkwana Mani Jerkindi. So it went to Sandra Bumla Marich was not like they. He joined India Day and Japan sent to know. So in a particular Hyderabad did not join. Hyderabad. Okay. Hyderabad did not. Hyderabad did not join. Mari Nizam asked. Nizam said that. Nizam said that nobody should hoist, nobody, nobody should hoist, nobody should hoist national flag, national flag, nobody should hoist national flag in Hyderabad state, in Hyderabad state, okay. So like that he addressed, he said, Nizam said that nobody should hoist national flag. Okay, should hoist national flag in Hyderabad state on 15th August. On 15th August like that, it was said. Okay, 1947, 15th August 1947. But Swami Ramananda Tirtha, I say, Nizam Chipina Pati Guda, Nizam Chipina Pati Guda, Swami Ramananda Tirtha, Hyderabad State Congress of Bill and the Chalamandini, this clearly Hyderabad Sultan Bazar Kotilo, Trivana Pataka and Agravis Nitlaga Tilsundi. Okay, so 15th August 1947 and Japesi Yanam. It went to Sandar Bumlo. At this moment, what happened in the sense Trivana Pataka and Agravis in the front day? So, under the guidelines of so there is in 1947, 15th August, Swami Ramananda Tirtha. Swami Ramananda Tirtha. Swami Ramananda Tirtha. He Swami Ramananda Tirtha by taking so all his people, by taking all the members, by taking all the members, okay, by taking, by taking all the members, all the members of Hyderabad State Congress, all the members, okay. So on 15th August, so that is 1947, at Sultan Bazar Koti, 15th August, 15th August 1947, Koti Sultan Bazar, Koti Sultan Bazar. This Sultan Bazar law, Swami Ramananda Tirtha asked a common person, Motilal, his name is Motilal. So he, in that uh, mob, he asked uh, Motilal to come and heist. Uh, National flag like that, it was hoisted by Motilal. Swami Ramananda Tirtha asked Motilal, Swami Ramananda Tirtha, Swami Ramananda Tirtha, Swami Ramananda Tirtha, okay, asked, asked a common man, a common man Motilal, a common man Motilal. Moti Lal to hoist national flag. To hoist to hoist national flag. National flag. At Koti Sultan Bazar. 
Okay. 15th August 1947, Koti Sultan Bazaar. Okay. At Koti Sultan Bazaar, Swami Ramananda Tirtha asked a common man, Motilal, to hoist it. Like that, so it was unfurled. Like that, it was unfurled. Like that, like that, national flag was unfurled. National flag, national flag was hoisted. Hoisted in Hyderabad. In Hyderabad. Thousands of people gathered. Nizam did not take any measure. Okay, it is uncontrollable like that. Nizam came to know that. Suppose if I take any measure, so to arrest or something, so one side already Telangana people's arm struggle that was going on. Telangana people's arm struggle that is going on. Now this is not the right time to take any activity against these people like that. Nizam did not take any activity against them. So like that anyhow what happened? Hyderabad did not join. So there is Indian Union. At this moment what happened? 15th August only India became uh, free. And uh, so these three did not join Indian Union. So originally four, but Trivendram, otherwise Thiruvananthapuram, we can say, so that joined. After that, three did not join. One is Jammu and Kashmir, one is Junagad, and one is Hyderabad. At last, these three did not join. Jammu, Kashmir, and Junagad, and Hyderabad. In Jammu, Kashmir, what happened? By sending army, got control over Jammu and Kashmir. Then in Junagad, Voting was conducted and 80% uh, people decided to join India like the Junagad also joined Indian Union because only 20% people Muslims and 80% people Hindu. That's why decided to join Indian Union. But Hyderabad what happened? Hyderabad did not join Indian Union like that we can see. Got idea? Hyderabad did not join. At last to join Hyderabad into Indian Union, Operation Polo was introduced like that it was said okay so in india in india in india three places did not join this three places so three places did not join three places did not join did not join we can say three places okay so three places didn't join three places didn't join Okay, which are these three in the sense one is Jammu and Kashmir, it did not join. So one is Jammu and Kashmir. So at last it joined. Okay, Sardar Vallabhai Patel sent army and got control over Jammu and Kashmir. Jammu and Kashmir did not join in the beginning. Did not join. So Sardar Vallabhai Patel, Sardar Vallabhai Patel sent army, sent army and got control and got control okay so like that there's another things which happened jammu and kashmir so then in junagadh that is also one junagadh calling this one as junagadh this junagadh also did not act join junagadh so in junagadh voting was conducted so here voting was conducted voting here voting was Voting was conducted, conducted, so there is, at last it joined the Indian Union, voting was conducted, voting was conducted and joined Indian Union. So I told you 80% people belong to Hindu and only 20% people belong to Muslim, that's why Junagadh, what happened, it joined Indian Union. Here voting was conducted and joined, so it joined Indian Union and it joined so, and it joined it joined indian union indian union so like that the problem of this also solved but hyderabad did not join hyderabad what happened in the sense hyderabad did not join with that only so there is a standstill agreement was concluded with nizam by this sardar Vallabhai. Patel, Union Government concluded, Government of India concluded standstill agreement. Hyderabad did not join. This when Hyderabad so did not join. Hyderabad did not join. Okay, Hyderabad did not join. With that, what happened in the sense? With that, 
stand still agreement was concluded with that with that stand still agreement stand still agreement stand still agreement was concluded with nizam stand still agreement was concluded concluded with nizam stand still agreement was concluded with nizam like that it was said with that stand still agreement was concluded with nizam you got idea so like that so things went on well in the period of this one stand still agreement we are calling so with that stand still agreement what is this stand still it was concluded on it was it was concluded it was concluded on it was concluded on 29th november 29th november 1947 this 1947 29th november 29th november 1947 only so what is this uh, concluded so it was uh, so stand still agreement was concluded okay so it is said that so which agreement in the sense so this uh, stand still agreement was concluded so stand with nizam so concluded on it was concluded on okay it was it was concluded on it was concluded on 29th november 1947 only okay at this moment what happened according to this agreement within one year the fate of hyderabad will be decided ఒక సంవత్సరం లోపు హైదరాబాద్ ఇష్యూని తేల్చడం జరుగుతుంది వితిన్ వన్ ఇయర్ సో ద ఫేట్ ఆఫ్ హైదరాబాద్ విల్ బీ డిసైడెడ్ ఓకే సో బా వితిన్ దిస్ టైమ్ సో నిజాం షుడ్ నాట్ ఫోర్స్ పీపుల్ టు జాయిన్ హైదరాబాద్ ఇన్ టు పాకిస్తాన్ హైదరాబాద్ని తీసుకెళ్లి పాకిస్తాన్లో కలవడానికి ప్రజలపై ఒత్తిడి తీసుకురాకూడదు ఈ షుడ్ నాట్ ప్రెజరైజ్ పీపుల్ టు జాయిన్ పాకిస్తాన్ అది ఒకటి రెండవది so security and safety that is looked after by government of india e stand still agreement prakaram security so hyderabad rajya rakshana evari badhyata ante bharat prabhutvam yokka badhyata ika bharat prabhutvam yokka currency anedi chellu baat avutundi hyderabad lo kuda bharat currency okay chellu baat avutundi ఈ ఇటువంటి సందర్భంలో మరి సో ఇవన్నీ పాయింట్స్ అన్నీ కూడా ఉన్నట్లుగా తెలుస్తుంది ఇందులో సో దే ఇస్ సో వాట్ హ్యాపెన్ ఇన్ ద సెన్స్ ఇట్ ఈస్ సెట్ దాట్ సో కరెన్సీ ఆఫ్ ఇండియా దట్ కెన్ బీ కంటిన్యూడ్ ఓకే అకార్డింగ్ టు స్టాండ్ స్టిల్ అగ్రిమెంట్ వాట్ ఆర్ ద ప్రిన్సిపల్స్ వాట్ ఆర్ ద వాట్ ఆర్ ద ప్రిన్సిపల్స్ వాట్ ఆర్ ద ప్రిన్సిపల్స్ ఆఫ్ అగ్రిమెంట్ స్టాండ్ స్టిల్ అగ్రిమెంట్ stand still what are the principle of stand still agreement ee agreement yokka so ee vidhanalu enti principles enti ante within one year the fate of hyderabad will be decided within one year it is said that within one year oka samvatsaram lop within one year the fate of hyderabad will be the fate of hyderabad will be decided the fate of hyderabad will be decided the fate of hyderabad will be decided okay within one year oka samasaram lopu hyderabad vishayam nirnayinchabadutundi the fate of hyderabad will be decided samasaram lopu decide avabadutundi nizam should not pressurize nizam nizam should not pressurize people should not pressurize should not pressurize okay should not pressure people to join should not pressure should not pressure people or force people to join pakistan to join pakistan to join pakistan pakistan lo cheramani pressure cheyagudu nizam should not pressure people to join pakistan and security of hyderabad will be the responsibility of indian government security security of hyderabad state security of hyderabad state security of hyderabad state is 
the responsibility of Indian government. Responsibility, responsibility of, responsibility of Indian government. Security of Hyderabad state is the responsibility of so providing security to Hyderabad state. Okay, providing security to, so there is Hyderabad state providing providing security to Hyderabad state. So is the responsibility of you Indian government. Indian government that you have to remember. Indian government. And Indian currency also will be continued. So in Hyderabad state, Indian currency also. Okay, freedom of people also must not be violated. Okay, Indian currency only. Indian currency. Indian currency will be continued. Will be continued. Indian currency will be continued. So in Hyderabad, in Hyderabad state, Indian currency will continue in Hyderabad state. That is also one of the opinion the points said in this one, Indian currency. So like that, all these, so and people's rights must not be violated. So then, people's rights must not be violated by Nizam. So like that, all these points are, so there in this standstill agreement. But a violated standstill agreement. But Nizam violated standstill agreement. But Nizam, Nizam Mir Usman Ali Khan, Mir Usman Ali Khan, Mir Usman Ali Khan violated, violated Mir Usman Ali Khan. But Nizam Mir Usman Ali Khan violated so this agreement, this agreement. Okay, so like that, that's the thing which happened. Got idea? Thank you.